The jailbreak live update is so close from now, okay? Like, Asimo and Bad CC just released information about this update, and it's going to be absolutely nuts, okay? So we've only had one other live update inside of this game before, and that was the lame volcano event back in 2018, okay? And that uh, live update, all that happened was a volcano started, like, you know, erupting, the city went down, a new city came up, and we got an ambulance. I mean, it sounds cool and all that stuff, right? Like, the city got renovated. But, like, think about it. It's only an aesthetic change, and it didn't really do that much to gameplay, okay? There wasn't any, like, boss fight or, like, uh, you know, special quest you have to do during the live challenge or anything like that, okay? Instead, all we got was just, um, like, a map revamp or something like that. But hopefully this live update is not that, okay, because it actually looks very, very promising, okay, let's go ahead and come over here to, uh, the Batimo page, who's ready for an update trailer, oh yeah, look at this, okay, save the date, Saturday, April 4th, 2020, 10 a.m. Pacific, 1 p.m. Eastern, 12 p.m. Central, and I believe that's like 5 p.m. GMT, whatever it's called, players of Roblox, we have an epic live event in Jailbreak, don't want to miss it, we'll add a countdown timer in-game. So let's go ahead and come over here to this trailer real quick. I'll go ahead and make it big. So I'm gonna go ahead and leave the music muted just in case it's copyrighted, but like you see all these guys like running in the city. Get ready for an epic live event. Okay, it's really dark, really rainy. Somebody's running to the military base. 10 a.m. PST on the 4th, okay. And, uh-oh, what's this? What could this possibly be? There's like uh, the security camera footage, there's a red button, no touch, and l what looks like a giant control room. And that guy that ran over to the criminal base or the Area 51 or whatever it is, let me see, okay, does it look like that guy over here? It sure does. Oh yeah, okay, let let's see. Uh, I think I need to like possibly do some editing here, okay? So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, just open this thing up in Photoshop and we're gonna do like some magic and see if we can tell exactly what's going on. Okay, so here we go. We have the image in here and if we make it really, really, really bright here, okay? This is what it looks like, okay? I brightened it up, made it extra sharp and it looks like we have ourselves. uh, let me see, can I zoom in? It looks like we got ourselves some crook here, okay? Now let's go ahead and see if we can make it even brighter. Uh, no, I don't think there's that much detail left inside of that guy, okay? So let's come over here, and, but looks like if you come over here, look at this shot, the guy looks very, very similar to this guy over here, okay? You see this shadow? Looks like the same guy that runs inside. So we're gonna get, like, NPCs running around the map. To be continued. Dun, 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 jailbreak. Okay. So this is definitely something very interesting, okay? Now, if you've paid attention to my channel or Creek's channel in the past, like, week or two, you probably noticed something about, like, a nuke silo and a time machine underneath Jailbreak, okay? So we have ourselves the Area 51 base over here, and there's this random cylinder, okay? Like, what the heck is this random cylinder doing? Okay, let's see if I can drop a rope, okay? Let's see, a uh, rope... And, uh, okay, can we go underneath the map? Please, Asimo, let me go underneath the map. I just want to go underneath the map today. Okay, so I just managed to, you know, uh, rope underneath the map here. We only have a limited amount of a uh, viewing space here, okay? But you can see that we have this little cylinder or, like, a uh, really funny amount of size polygon here. So, what could this be? Okay, everyone thinks it's a nuke silo. So, if you go ahead and search the nuke silo, this is exactly what nuke silos look like. Okay, there are giant holes in the ground, and you stick a freaking missile down inside of that tube. And does that remind you of the jailbreak hole in the ground? Because that very well looks like a nuke silo. And, uh, hold up. I think there's, like, a clue in the music here. Okay, let's go back and turn the sound on real quick. Okay, right here. You hear that, like, tornado siren, that nuke sound, whatever it's called, okay? Like that wailing, uh, siren noise. That thing reminds me of, like, that alert in Car Crushers 2 before the nuke drops, which means it's very, very likely to be a nuke. I'm not sure if it's actually a nuke, though, because Asimo is hinting at me and Creek being clowns earlier, so, uh... 
Yeah, I don't know what that could possibly mean. But for now, we're going with nukes. And we have this giant nuke silo over here. And uh, wait, what happens if I come over here? No! Okay, does it even have... Okay, I don't think it's anything underneath the map. Okay, so this is very interesting. I'll just go ahead and tumble down here until we go oof. So there's one more thing I want to show you guys, okay? But I think I might need to get myself a jetpack. Actually, no. All I think I need is an ATV, okay? And I don't even think I really need to go on this object, but you guys will probably know there's a time machine under jailbreak. And I still have no idea if that time machine has something to do with nukes, okay? Or maybe it's gonna revert back to, like, day one jailbreak or something like that, but, uh, who the actual heck knows at this point besides Asimo and Bad CC. So I managed to glitch myself out of the, uh, map over here, and boom! There it is. The time machine, okay? It's that one thing that Creecraft had, like, a ton of trouble getting onto, and he constantly took a bunch of L's. Okay, now it's daytime, so we should be able to see it a little bit better. Okay, if you come over here, it literally is a freaking time machine. Okay, let's turn down my graphics. Maybe that helps. Who knows? No, that did not help at all. Okay, th this graphics is like the best I can really get it. But you can see we got like this uh, time capsule TARDIS looking thingamajig. And, uh, you know, initially we thought it was like the Doctor Who event, but nope. That thing was just like some free like hats and stuff. There wasn't any actual games to it. So we know it can't be for that. Maybe, just maybe on April Fool's Day, we're getting time travel back to OG Day 1 Jailbreak. That, that's just a theory, okay? But I feel like that might happen, considering it is a time machine. Or, it could be like, a broken time machine. Maybe it's just like a fancy alarm clock, ticking down at when a nuke will go kaboomy inside the jailbreak, who knows? But yeah, there definitely is this very, very suspicious time machine underneath here, okay? And, uh, its purpose will remain unknown for a good while now, okay? Because we won't really get to know it until it's, like, gone. So, uh, yeah, I think that's basically it for the uh, time machine. Let's go ahead and go, like, uh, dig a little bit more deeper. So another thing that was completely unrelated to, like, any of the stuff that released, like, uh, the day before the video comes out... I found the video of this random guy that managed to exploit into the admin panel or something like that on Jailbreak. So I'm not sure if you can see behind the face cam here, but there's like this funny box. So I think now you guys can probably see the uh, test event button down here, okay? That thing is very suspicious. Like if I just come over here, this is the only thing I'm going to show. A lot of lightning. I'm not sure if this is accurate or not. How accurate this might be if this guy just like, you know, actually like just, you know, made a clone of Jailbreak and started doing something. I'm not sure if this is even like the real deal or not at this point. It's just some random leak tossed around on like a Twitter, take of a grain of salt. So yeah, this is like, apparently just a whole bunch of lightning bolts. And I doubt these lightning bolts are the event. Because if it is the event, it will be really lame. Okay, let's be honest here. There's probably some hacker just playing around in Asimov's toolbox. So I think that leak that's been going around, in case you guys have seen it, it's probably just like some troll, okay? I, I doubt that's gonna be the event, because if, if like, I'm, I'm gonna tell you this. If the event is just a whole bunch of lightning and thunderbolts, just make it a weather cycle, like, let's be honest, okay? <laughs> it's probably not gonna be just lightning. So that's why I'm thinking, like, me, Creek, and everyone else, it's probably gonna be nukes, okay? Like, we got this giant nuke silo in the middle of the, uh, Area 51 here. The flag is constantly changing, like, uh, countries. I think if I turn down my graphics a little bit, like this, uh, who knows if that's enough, okay? But if I go far enough away from this flag, alright, hopefully this still works, okay? Because I remember it used to quite a bit. You guys can probably see that flag looks very, very, very different now. Okay, I'm gonna see if I can go closer without it, like, revert. Okay, there, it just reverted. Uh, let's see here. Okay, now, now it's back to the original. So I went ahead and took a picture of this flag here. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and zoom the actual heck out of this image, okay? And boom. That's very interesting, okay? I'm not sure if I can do any sharpening, but I'm gonna go ahead and zoom this in even more. Okay, I think you guys might be able to see it. That is 100% a China flag. That may or may not have anything to do with nukes, but it's definitely something suspicious as well. No idea how long that's been in the game. It might have been in the game for a really, really, really long time and I just haven't seen it or uh, something else, okay? But anyway, this is right next to the nuke silo. It's completely uh, solid, can't really go inside. So I have no idea if it's actually a nuke silo or not, but 
what else would it be? Would it be like a manhole to a sewer? I doubt it would be like this wide for a manhole to a sewer. Or, uh, you know, a drainage valve. Well, I mean, it did rain, so it could be just a drainage valve, but I doubt that. Okay, why would Asimo add lame things into the game? Okay, so he, like, he'd honestly just add, uh, you know, what's it called? A nuke silo. So, yeah, I guess that is basically gonna be it for my uh, predictions for this update here. Uh, I'm just kind of, like, floating underneath the map. <laughs> oh, man, this is really interesting. So, I think it's gonna be nukes. What do you guys think? Okay, let me know in the comment section down below your predictions and all that good stuff. If you guys enjoyed this uh, video, you guys know exactly what to do. Hit like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what you guys think everything's gonna be like. Use code Baker when you buy Robux or Premium in the shop. Join my Discord if you want a chance at winning like some free stuff I do every now and then. And uh, yeah, see you guys next time.